this video is still on linear algebra. We are on the chapter of vectors uh, in the vector spaces. We are doing a series of proofs with vectors. Okay, this time we are asked to prove that k plus k prime where k and k prime are real numbers, so these are scalars, k plus k prime times uh, vector u equals k times u plus k prime times, uh, this is not v, this should be vector u. Okay, so vector u of course, it's in the Rn space. So, what is vector u? Vector u will have components u1, u2, to un, right? And this case, k and k prime are real numbers. So, what is k plus k prime times u? Well, that will be k plus k prime, these are two scalars, times the vector u, that's u1, un. So, so this is the same as k plus k prime times u1, so the, the scalar will uh, multiply each component, k plus k prime times u1, k plus k prime times u2, till k plus k prime times u n. So this is like k times u1 plus k prime times u1 because we can distribute the scalars by each component. k times u2 plus k prime times u2, etc. till k times u n plus k prime times u n. So this is like k times u1 plus k times u2 because uh, k times u1 plus k time k prime times u1 we can separate okay so i put the very the, the first components on one side k times u1 plus k times u2 plus k times un plus k prime times u1 etc till play k prime times un so uh, I'm sorry, uh, uh, I, I missed a step here. Since k is multiplying every single component, I can put k outside here. So k times u, k u1 plus k u2 plus k u n, I can put k times u1 plus u2 plus u n. And I can do the same here. k prime times u1 plus k prime times u2 plus k prime times u n. I can put k prime outside times u1 plus a un. But u1 till un is the vector u here. So and this one is the vector u2. So k times u1 plus it's the same as k times u1 plus k times uh, k prime times u. Okay, but that concludes the the proof because we just proved that k plus k prime times u is the same as k times u plus k prime times u as we were asked to prove.